My objection is that the nation needs Air India for a number of reasons, not just for commercial purposes. Hmm. The whole concept of public sector was based not on what the government should run and not run. Hmm. It was based on the question of what is in the national interest to be in the state sector and what is to be given away, uh, left, uh, left alone for the private sector. Huh. Now, that's what we uh, have in the constitution too, right. because we are a welfare state. We are not a capitalist state. Uh -huh. Okay, so what, uh, what is the problem with the Air India? It is showing loss. Who's responsible for that? Hmm. You went and bought aircraft for 70,000 crores when you, 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 you are reducing the routes, hmm. Uh, hmm. To the routes on which it was flying. All the profitable routes were given to Etihad and Emirates and Qantas and so on. Hmm. Uh, hmm. And then you, you bleed the Air India. Hmm. Then you subject it to government control. You don't allow the chairman of the uh, Air India to... Uh, run it like a, a business enterprise.